Good day, everyone. Here we go for another episode of Kakamping Wednesday, hosted by me, Roy Japantor. Today, napaka importante po nito. Uh, nandito po tayo sa Katsuoji Temple. Ano po ba ang Katsuoji Temple? Dito po, sa temple na to, pumupunta ang lahat ng may hangarin na gusto nilang ipanalo ang isang bagay. Maging ito po ay sa larangan ng kanilang sports o kaya sa kanilang career, sa trabaho, gusto nilang uh, ma-promote o kaya naman po kung estudyante sila meron silang exam na gusto nilang ipasa at kung politisya naman po sila katulad po ni ng ating mahal na BP Lenny na kumakandidato bilang presidente ng ating uh, bansang Pilipinas eh tamang-tama po itong lugar na to para po ipag ang kanyang tuluyang pagkapanalo sa halalan 2022. So, andito po ako ngayon para magpray para kay BP Lenny. Samahan niyo po ako ngayon dito sa Katsuoji Temple. The History of Katsuoji Temple dates back to 727 AD when the two Buddhist monks Zen Chu and his brother Zen Zan built a hut where they devoted themselves to Buddhism almost 40 years later in the year 765 AD Prince Kaijo Emperor Konin's son with the help of Zen Chu and Zen Zan, established Mirokuji Temple in place of the hut the two brothers had built. Their mission was to reach the spiritual realm of Buddha. In 880 AD, the Emperor Sewa fell ill and devoted flock to Mirokuji to pray for his recovery. After overcoming his illness, many own this miracle to Mirokuji Temple, and the Emperor later renamed the temple Katsuoji, the Temple of the Victorious King. Katsuoji, the temple that healed the Emperor. Among the candidates for the presidency, this lovely lady from Bicol, Maria Lenor Leni Erona Robredo, the one that is always being mocked, rejected, criticized, and loved at by her critics. Most of them are even good Christians and Catholics and Oragons, Bicolanos. Somebody even wants her disqualified, yet she is right there, still standing. Here is lady politicians who doesn't go down to the level of her critics. She never pays attention to all the negative things they say or write about her. She just measures their criticisms of her in inches. She walks proud and still smiling and just keep on working. She knows very well that fools will criticize, condemn, or will make fun of her, as most fools do. But as we see, she is still very understanding and forgiving. That is why her critics hate her so much. They can't just destroy her, bring her down to their level with their criticisms. 
the more they criticize her, the more she becomes popular. To be humble is to be great. Right now, the world is watching, and the tide of popular opinion is on her side. Kaya mga kakamping, dito lang tayo kay Lenny. See ya! Planuhin ang pamamasyal upang masigurong sulit ang inyong bakasyon sa Land of the Rising Sun. Respetado at mapagkakatiwala ang Filipino Tour Operator sa Japan. Roy Japan Tour. Roy Japan Tour. Contact WhatsApp and Viber 8190238858888.